Hey, welcome back to Ocean Uh We're at episode 17, maybe? There's, I don't know, I'm not sure when we got 16. I, my way of measuring is I've just got a folder and it tells me there's 16 items and they're all videos, so I assume it's a 17, why not? Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, let's see, where did we leave? We, oh, we got the, let me go down and just have a look at it. You haven't seen this. You weren't here. You made me go do it all by myself. Where the hell do I live? Oh, right. I put that in. Well, there's a reason for that, actually. If you, I don't know if you want to come down here. You won't, you won't be able to see as well just looking over for, to, to my screen. The, uh, the four slime chunks down here are all dried out, cleared out, and, you know, sheltered. So there's uh, water above and around it. But uh, Glowstone, which I don't like very much, but... We're getting slimes. Uh, I'll probably get some behind me, in fact. I wouldn't be too surprised. So we don't have much of a slime shortage anymore. We got this going on. Oh, that's the only one. Um, <clears throat> as it happens, I don't know when we got it. I noticed it. Uh, I don't know if it was 2017 or 2018, which means I'm not sure which version. But uh, these things, if the small ones, the ones that you when you hit the at the, the last stage, you hit them and you get some, uh, get the slime ball. Uh, evidently, they're now good at climbing ladders. The big ones might be able to, but I never usually have ladders uh, wide enough for them. This still goes into whatever we're doing here. I uh, had to use stairs here to, you know, there are uh, slabs to, uh, you, know, it, you know, there was no sneaking in even. It just didn't work. That, I think, just works... Uh, and goes all the way to zero, so. Yeah, it, it's simple. Uh, long term, we could probably replace the sand and uh, uh, clay. I think there's dirt beneath that, I would assume. Uh, we could replace all that with more wood or whatever. Uh, just because right now it's not real Enderman proofed in here. Right. But on the other hand, you know. If an Enderman steals this block... There's sand behind it. There's this here. Nothing's going to leak in. It's not going to matter that much. Um, could also... Not, well, yeah, kind of. We could uh, um, talk about getting rid of this ladder because it's kind of slow. Probably immediately uh, just down there at the bottom have a little... Uh, you know, it's, it's, oh, it's closed on three sides have just something like this or a plate on the floor that, uh, yeah, it just, it, there's no reason necessarily to close it, but I, once I got all that lit up and, and we had the stuff coming in, or, you know, the floor was in place above the bedrock, yeah. came up and turned around and there was a slime following me, so, if you don't want them up here bumping you off the world. Uh, let's see, I've got my half-assed ovenator is nothing really, it's just stuff goes in stuff like this goes in that I don't need for anything anymore, probably. Uh, it's just cooking uh, cobblestone down into uh, smooth stone, which uh, I, I have a plan for this. This is needless. At least it should be. I could rebuild the uh, cobblestone generator. I, I can make just a stone generator is what I can make, which, all things being equal, would be a little faster. Um, with, with any given pickaxe, chopping through uh, cobblestone takes like 3% longer than chopping through stone. And if we can get silk touch on something, let's say something like this with silk touch and mending and efficiency, you'd be right through all three of those twice a sec. Well, however, at the speed of it growing back, really, you would outpace the uh, stuff growing back. I've done it. <coughs> oh, that's all I filled that out because I had the soul sand stuff to work with. Um, so I'm thinking, I have a couple of things I want to do. I kind of like to figure out what the hell's going on with this, because it's just weird. I know there's llamas up here. It's, it's where they spawn. I think it's the only place I've seen a trader. I'm not sure about that, but it seems like it. I saw llamas on the ground. Oh, did you? Yeah. I don't know if traders are lasting long in there. I don't know if they're getting killed or just giving up and disappearing later or what. I, what's... That's that. There is that. That's the problem. It's a problem. 
A bigger problem, I can't figure out. There's, you saw the ceiling, there's no holes. Yeah. I don't think there's any holes on the sides. And yet, and especially if I could like come out of the nether and this takes a second to load, so it's all x-rayed. Right about, you know, just three or four meters down from where they get pushed in, or where they fall in, they're not being pushed. Skeletons in particular are suddenly on fire. So that one just fell over dead. Why would that happen? Is the llama killing him? Is that what happens? Well, I I, I, don't know. I think I remember that llamas attack things that hurt them. Maybe it's it's okay. But I don't know why it's still alive. I just got nothing better to do. I don't know. Um. All right. So then we. Uh, I also want to do uh, sugar cane, and it's two separate things, but they're the, basically the same thing. So it's just replicating the thing twice. It's basically the same thing. Uh, bamboo don't need uh, water. I think they can have water, but it doesn't do any good. These need water. Uh, I want to do a, an automated uh, reed farm thingy. And then similarly, an automated bamboo. The automated reed farm, apart from stockpiling reeds for us so we can turn into paper, uh, could have... The way I tend to do these, th I don't have any way to draw it out, and I don't have anything quite like it at the moment, but you'd have, and it'd be about the size of this, uh, this thing here, you know, just, this is like essentially nine by nine, you know, if you go straight it like that. Uh, it's actually more, I mean, it, it, it's like seven by seven typically, but then there's a lot, we should sleep, there's little bits poking off in places. You, uh... At seven by seven, I mean it's actually seven times four is what it is. You have seven. It, seven is just a good number to fit into everything and have it work as well as I can get it working. It could probably be bigger, but then you have slowdowns with redstone and things. So you you more or less have. Well, you know what? Let me. I can pick these up again later. Uh, oh, I can just use these. And this will be up off the world, but because I've got slabs here, but uh, what you would have, let me just go, do I still have a, just a big open plot over here? I think so, yeah. You're there, so you'd know. Yeah. All right, so we have his, uh, you know, four, uh, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. I mean, this is not terribly important to build this out necessarily, but just to show you what I want. On the corners, for sure, there would be tracks for a minecart. Uh, here and here, these two would be hoppers facing out into a box to collect. That would be real. Basically, the whole thing can mostly be tracks, but then we want a cart that's going around and around above the, the the tracks in the cart are basically the same level so you're up one here and then uh track with a cart on it is level two level three is just dirt suspended in the air whether there's a cart it stays up you can sand uh it'll be up above the uh um uh mine cart that's rolling around and then on the dirt you have either uh bamboo or uh sugarcane and uh, then there's, you know, a series of, well, probably I don't want to waste the material. I can get away with, to do both of these, I can use eight observers. Just put them in the middle because, you know, put them on slot four out of seven. And the observers are up a couple of more levels from, if, if this is on, if this is the level above the minecart, this stays in place because we don't want a breaking. This is a... Up against this would be a piston, and above that would be above the piston would be an observer, waiting for something to get in front of it here. And if you're just doing you know four on a system, and it's just the middle one, uh, when the middle middle bamboo thing, middle reed gets in sight, it gets up to where the observer can see it. It pretty much uh, the the three to either side are likely to be in the same basic altitude, uh, and then the redstone signal from there is really just out and over three, it's, it powers the whole row. 
the trick with that is this. So, uh, bent rail, so it turns a corner. Steel rail here and here to go across hoppers because you don't want uh, powered rails on hoppers if you can help it. You can actually, and that would be a curved steel rail. Uh, with the resources, you can have like just a uh, redstone block here with a powered rail on it and then two more powered rails so you get up to maximum speed, basically three powered rails in a row, just in time to get here and turn the corner. Which means you would have, you know, three, six, twelve powered rails, which is two sets of them. Twenty-four, which is four, because I got the whole other this thing to play with. I have zero gold. We just don't have it. We're not getting it. Or I'm not seeing a lot of places to look for it. I've been in the nether, I've been climbed up to the platform I have in there, looked down to see if anything would spawn. I finally got a pigman on like our staircase, because it's not really a staircase, it's a series of slabs, which means 50% of them are uh, spawning surfaces. Hmm. We're just, I don't know why, but we are not getting any damn pigment, no matter where I sit waiting for him to spawn and expect expect him to spawn somewhere. It's, it never happens. Could and I what? Ask a um, if you try, yeah. Why a minecart? Why rails? Oh, because... Okay. With that shape, you have the dirt uh, above the shape. So it, it more or less looks like this, but a little higher up. <coughs> and then the piston goes up against this one because the observer tells the piston go up against that one. This is as tall as these get. With the bamboo, you could actually have the observer up higher, but there's no real need. You know, they all grow at whatever rate. They'll all, they'll be fine. It just happens faster, so you get less, but more often. Um, <clears throat> when you build one of these things, the best, the most efficient design, really the only one that works as such, is have uh, the the piston would be right here, right, you know, above this block on this level, and then the observer. Um, and then behind that block, and, you know, up so that it can't go any... You don't want the reeds going off in any direction. So you have, like, glass or whatever behind them. And the only place they can do... The, the only thing they can do once they're cut is drop straight down onto the block that they originated. Well, or one to the side, it doesn't matter that much. <clears throat> but now they're stuck there. You can't just put a hopper under grass. You can put a hopper under, like, carpet or something, but... Even, even a, I have over here, uh, you can even do a, uh, a slab. But you can't grow reeds on a slab, so it's irrelevant. Um, so what you need is a cart that uh, has a hopper in it that rolls around. And uh, it, it just slurps the stuff through the grass, dirt, whatever, sand. Okay, so you can't... And then it rolls across other hoppers and the, those hoppers pull it out of the cart. You could arguably um, just have 28 carts, I guess. Uh, all Each one sitting on a rail that's on a hopper that, you know, that feeds into a system. Um, the flaw in that is that uh, mine carts really like to just roll for no reason. Right. So it would work half the time in the sense that if you put down a rail it's going gonna, it's gonna to point either... What is it? It's like... Is it north? I don't even know. Do I have any rails? I doubt it. It's not... It's not that important an element. It, the, the point is, if you, have a, if, you're, if you have rails next to each other and they're linking, uh, the minecart on it, if you put one down here and one down here and one down here, by the time you get one, done with seven, they're starting to like clump up and leaving gaps, and it's just a mess... I was just wondering if it was impossible to like reliably fling what was broken into water and have it flow to a center point. Um, reliably, yeah, it's impossible. Okay. Just just because too huge a percentage will necessarily la land directly on the source block. There are, I don't know, possibly. How does water affect reeds at this point? I'm new here. 
Mm-hmm. Because <laughs> you might not be too far off. Let me have... We have dirt somewhere. Let me have... Uh, <coughs> Let me just find something. I need a. Uh, just give me. A, doesn't really matter how how many. I hadn't really thought about it. I mean, it's possible maybe that. Um. I don't know. Let me check. I won't say it's not possible anyway. Oh, what's not possible is planting. I just went up too high. Yeah, I can't even do that. Well, I can do this. I'll just do this. That's cool. Um, if water came in from some direction, then is this going to go forward? What's it going to do? I think I'm going to try. Uh, well, I'm hitting shift. Is that relevant? It's not water logging. I know you can theoretically. I kind of forgot it was an option. It's really ignoring that. So, well, the problem is if it lands in it, because it could, and then apparently we're not going to be pushing it anywhere. Um, what? Oh, because I did that. I don't know. Hang on a minute. Apparently I broke something, and I don't know what. Why in hell? What did I? Where did I put the water that is not going the hell away? Is that right? Oh, I see. Yeah, that's not a guy. Source block. I don't know. Didn't really mean to, but it's, uh, what the hell is that? Okay, listen. Come here. No, that's not. That doesn't help me. Uh, no, I'm not sure what I can do about the block that I left. I don't care about that. So what I'm trying to decide, what I'm thinking, if we can't rely in any way on pigmen existing, at least in number, the funny thing, I don't even need much. I can't think of anything I'm going to need gold for apart from this thing, which means I basically need to get four sets of rails, which is 24 ingots. Then, then we'd be fine. That's all I need. Where... Um, yeah, I'm waiting on you. I, I was, I suddenly realized that I don't have my bow or... Uh, I don't know. Um, so, an alternative might be, we're not getting Wentworths, we're not getting water zombies. Uh, because it's, a, I think because of the flat world, so they're just not, they don't know where to spawn. We're not getting fish. Or, I think sea level is effectively the bedrock at the bottom, that's how it works now. It, when this was made, it was different. Um, I'm wondering, and I got some stuff here to try this, which the more I think about it, I might have overbuilt this. Uh, but give me all of this anyway. Um, see, they're on fire. Why are you on fire? What might work... Oh, I need something I don't have if I'm going to do it this other way. Is uh, to... Do I have... Well, I can have... Yeah, I'll just take, steal this. I know where the... It's fine. Um, what I wonder is if I had that sign first of all, it's got to go in and, and, uh, 
but what is that? Get away so I can see. That's uh, 68. Oh, it doesn't matter. I gotta put this in a certain. Well, okay, it matters tragically. Hang on a minute. 68. So I want 69 for something. Damn it. This is gonna suck. Um. Where's 60? That, oh, it's above that, obviously. I don't need a creeper coming in right now and bugging me. Uh, if I... No, I'm just going to have to... If it shows up, I'll have to do... Yeah, there's one. Yeah, they don't take much to kill. You know, I could... If I took that out, I guess it would... Well, I don't know. I'll just do it this way and see what happens. If I can put this... Oops. Put this in... Here... Oh, actually, that's not what I want to do at all. Um, put the dispenser in. Oh, God. I'm just going to have to be fairly quick about it. Can, can I do this? Is it going to let me... Okay. Get out of the way so I can rebuild what I need to rebuild. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Get off my screen. Where? So many creepers. Hang on. The dispenser, I can put water in and uh, basically flood the element of uh, this. What happened to all my. I don't care. Get out. Leave. Give me that. And I don't care about that. So give me that. Uh, I'm just going to get this rebuilt because that's, what the, yeah, that'll, oh, damn it. Get in there, get in there, get, I don't care right now. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, this goes, I don't know where the hell, but it goes somewhere. I, why, what, was this here? Was it, I can't really guess why the hell that would have been there, but it was. That's weird. Well, I, hmm. Oh, he's probably on this side to prevent things. Yeah, I know what it was, yeah. Okay, so with that in there, I can flood this, although the first thing that'll happen is it'll just float up. So I also need, uh, somehow, this is why I wanted to get it done first, but I didn't. Uh, right there. I mean, it could be. It might as well be. Well, yeah, maybe not. Maybe I'll do it over here. What's, what altitude? Uh, give me a number. 69. So I want 70. It's going to be over here. And, uh, what do I have for to live with? Um, what is that? Bottom. Go right there for a sec. Nope, didn't work. Leave, can't see. Because I did that, apparently. All right, go there. Uh, just go up a bit. And this is going to be weird because I got... I could get away with that, I guess. Probably. If I had this... Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, that's going to be... Never mind. But that... Give me something that's not this. Give me the... Uh, I don't know why the hell I was thinking that. That's 70. Um... What's difficult about what I want you to do? Go there. Right? Yeah, and then one more because it has to go behind that. Um, get back up there somehow without triggering and don't need this anymore. Creeper. Uh, get rid of this so I can climb. Give me those back so I have something to climb. That's a damn... No! Okay. Uh, give me that. No. Where in hell is my hatchet? Where could it possibly live right now? What? <sighs> the ability of this game to just get dead.
Shut up, no. If I can somehow get that into... There we go. Alright, and then... It's a creeper. Uh, I don't care, so give me some of these. I don't know why the hell that's even there. If I do this, can that thing see me? Okay. You know, if that thing blows up, it just changes everything I'm doing right now. Alright, so, if I can figure out where I just put all that. Is that more or less back the way I want it? Sure. Give me the levers. Yeah. Which I have more than I need. Um, I'm pretty sure I can just throw a lever on that. I don't think it'll hurt anything. And that the lever needs to be somewhere a little awkward. Please do your job. So that closes that. If I had in here one of these, this sign is in place. I'm pretty sure if I do this right now, that thing is now underwater. At least, the, you know, its head is. And it can't float away because... Can it? Yeah, it's just there. Um, which does no good at the moment because I don't happen to have any uh, uh, zombies at all. But if I had... If I had that retracted, turn that off. Oh, wait, does that turn it off or does it... I'm not sure. Let me check. No, it... There we go. Um... Arguably, a zombie, it wouldn't matter what else was in there, really. If we got a zombie in there, and I've got how long to, like, three minutes to see if I can get one. If I get a zombie in there and don't kill it right away, I can, uh, seal with the, with the piston, I can seal off its escape. I don't want it floating away and just bobbing on top of the water instead of becoming anything. Throw the water in to drown it, get a drowned zombie, and then in the end, just, then I just walk up and hack everything that I've got caught. These probably don't have to be alive this whole time. It just doesn't matter. I don't know if it'll work overall, so I'm thinking more... See, the problem is... Zombies are a really good monster for defying all machines. I can make one of these things that only gives me creepers. I can make one that only gives me spiders. I can make one that only gives me, uh... Uh... Which I'm not sure how I would make a skeleton-specific one. Zombies show up everywhere, unless they don't. If you can get a zombie, you can get damn near everything else. I can, I can make this thing not have spiders, despite having zombies. That's as good as... I can't even not have Endermen with this design. I could if there were water channels up there, but that's not the case. I might rebuild, I might build a new one and in, incorporate this into it. That, I, I'm not that annoyed that we're getting Endermen. We are up to like, I think, 10 of these. We need, uh, 12 to activate the portal and then we can just go into the end and get all the, all the pearls we want. Oh, we also have this. We can melt these down, I suppose. But if I melt down all of these, I get less than half of one ingot, and I need uh, 24 ingots. Yeah. I know, so I need a lot. We need like a couple hundred. We need 200 and uh, uh, 26. 26? How, how, where did I get that? 9 times 24 is what we need. So 200 and uh, 31 maybe sounds right. So, yeah, I don't know. I haven't seen a zombie yet. I don't know if you noticed. I'm not sure how I'm going to get... It. And part, and I still don't know why they're... Maybe the zombies just aren't even surviving. Let me check. Are we getting zombie meat hitting? There's 48 in there. I don't know if that means anything. I don't know how long it's been in there. I guess I can grab them. It doesn't really kill me to melt these down. It's just... It's not a good system. It's not reliable. There's four of, like, yeah, two. I think it is 231. That sounds about right. No, it can't be. I don't think. Because... At least by popular consent.
inception, any multiple of 9 is made up of numbers that add up to 9, and 231 adds up to 6. So I'm off somewhere, I don't know where. <sighs> oh, I know, yeah, I know what I'm doing wrong. It's, it's still a couple hundred, though, a little over a couple hundred. Um, see, I don't know what the hell's going on with zombies. I'm not seeing anything. Um, at all. Yeah, gunpowder's happening. It was really annoying me. A bit. We're not, there's no coral on this map. It's all water and there's no coral. I, I don't know what I would use it for, but if I had coral, I could make a, uh, dynamite duplicator. Hmm. And blow the hell out of something. <laughs> just forever and ever. I don't know what I would blow up, but it'd be something, I'm sure of that. You mostly just want to blow something up? Oh, it just... I'm always a little amused by Moyang don't want you having a way to duplicate anything, particularly dynamite. Mm. And they just, every time, they accidentally leave something in that allows for it. And at this point, it, you do a kind of a little flying machine. It, it actually is kind of a flying machine, but it's, uh, you use a few slime blocks to build kind of a, something that looks a little like this, although it's somewhat smaller. Put a uh, there was a zombie. Yeah, but it died. Yeah. Well, okay. How fluky was that? Why did it die? I think the answer is tear this damn thing down. Because there's something is very wrong with it. Even if I build a replacement right where this is, for one thing I would use, you know, that's why I'm cooking, one of the reasons I'm cooking this stuff up. So... You know, when I get these out to about here, you know, looping us, get get about a dozen of these. That'd be enough to do what I need to do. I can, uh, I can just, I have a, well, sometimes I have a couple of water buckets. I can take those up with me and create a water channel thingy that, uh, uh, you know, does that for me. Kills off Endermen before they become part of the thing. I'm sure we can get two more bullets. Well, you can buy them, actually. I think the cleric had. Let me check. I've been talking to him a lot, so. Oh, yeah, I took out the uh, scaffolding and, and trap doors. Things were actually spawning on those things. I don't know. I've never seen that, but it's what happened. Uh, I, wow, I actually don't have him opened up yet. But I'm pretty sure eventually he gets uh, bowling balls for me. Come on. I don't know why this is being slow. Don't think real hard, just come here. Where's Cleric? Should have bowling balls later. And right now we're at this point, I guess he's just... I can only... Every day he he's willing to let me buy redstone here. But uh, uh, only 12 at a time, only 6 emeralds. And... I usually I go over and talk to the guys who want clay, get basically a stack of emeralds every day out of these guys. Go talk to him, there's 12 emeralds, here, give me six rubies. And I'm just, I'm still slowly building them up to the point where I can uh, get bowling balls. It will happen, that could probably... Where we're stuck there is that it's just kind of a chore to go in and get more uh, blaze rods at the moment to build more brewing stands to get more clerics. But, you know, it's how it's going on. No meat, so I guess we just didn't get a zombie. Lead. I don't know, I think we're out of time. Chore is a very funny word for it. Well, it's not, yeah, it's, it's a word. Really, suicide mission is the right word. Mm -hmm. Um, With that, you know, again, I'm thinking I might uh, tear out the ladder here and just install a bit of water down on the ground that we can just drop in and then build next to this, a, uh, you know, somewhere next to it. A way back up using existing water, probably because that's easy. That uses soul sand that we can just step on and shoot up, and it'll be fast. Will that let the uh, little slimes come up? Uh, it might, I guess. I don't know. I'm not too worried about those. The they're harmless. They bump into you. You just kick them. You don't. You, you don't need a weapon or anything. They just die. So, yeah, it it's a thought. I don't know. Um, we're out of time here, so. That I'm planning toward all this. I don't have... Everything I want to do, I don't have... I'm missing one thing. 
so I want to do something else to get that one thing, and then I'm missing one thing, and I've got this weird machine that's producing animal or monsters that apparently not zombies, so I can't even turn them into, I don't know. But there's no other place to try to... Anything else where I would try to create water zombies would be less manageable. It's just awkward, and I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I don't know, I'll work on it, get some stuff built up, because, you know, it doesn't have to be on camera to build it. And we'll just see you next time, so bye.